Did anyone see you walking into the building? No, no, I, I use the secret back entrance that you told me to use. Uh, why all the mystery? Who's trying to destroy you? Took you long enough. Uh, you're avoiding my question. Who's trying to destroy you? Whatever you think you heard, you're mistaken, Vincent. No, I, I distinctly you heard know, you say that... I'm here for a reason. Would you like to know what it is or not? Fine. Go ahead. Uh, tell me why a lowly tabloid reporter like myself has been summoned to the almighty altar of crane power. I can just as easily ask you to leave. Fine. Uh, sorry. Go ahead. I'm, I'm all ears. Tell me why you asked me here. I need your help. Really? Uh, what kind of help would that be? Do you remember when J.T. Cornell delivered his envelope to your tabloid? Yeah, sure. Uh, I brought it to that wedding. Uh, one more poor old J.T. was uh, found dead in that wedding cake. Yeah, that, that was my wedding. Ah, uh, oops. Sorry. <clears throat> you said there was nothing in it, right? Uh, right, but uh, from the impression on the envelope, we think that it contained J.T.'s USB memory stick. Good. I need you to find that memory stick. See, it seems to have certain information on it that has fallen into the wrong hands. The hands of the mystery person who wants to destroy you. Just find me that memory stick. Someone seems to be very interested in my personal life, my family, my children, and it has to do with that memory stick. Well, you've come to the right man, Mrs. Crane. If anyone can find that flash drive, it's me. But, uh, you're gonna have to give me more details about the information on that stick that someone's using against you. You'll be told what you need to know, nothing more. Remember, Vincent, I'm head of the Empire. And if you try anything cute, try to cross me, I'll crush you. Of course, I, I wouldn't think of crossing you, Mrs. Gray. Good. And one more thing. Don't let anyone know what you're doing, because I'm in a very delicate situation right now. Oh, you mean the balancing act you're doing between Jared Casey and Ethan Winthrop? No more questions from you, Vincent. Do what you're told. Get me that memory stick. And as you can see, you will be paid very well for your efforts. And if you succeed in helping me, you'll get a substantial bonus. Tess, what's going on? Why are you hiring this creep to help you? Tess, what's going on? This guy is a reporter for a sleazy tabloid. Why would you trust him enough to hire him for anything? I'll ignore that slanderous remark, Jared, and ask what you're doing here. I thought you dumped Mrs. Crane. You know, you put one word of this in your tabloid, your career will end. Do you understand? Sorry. Uh, I ask questions on instinct. It's, it's what I do. Okay, well, what you can do now is leave. Fine. Uh, right. <clears throat> you know, uh, I'll just show myself out. No, 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 no. I'll, I'll walk you to the elevator. Yeah.